Orange County Crating is a family-owned business with over 40 years' experience located in the city of Orange. From a small box to a large custom crate, no package or piece of equipment is too complicated for the premier crating company of Southern California. The website's been kicking my ass trying to get the thing done. Jim calls Tony and I at the last second and says, hey man, I got a pick in Buena Park, go get a truck. So I come in, nice gentleman inside. Uh, there have been some stuff stripped off the walls inside already from another dealer. He said, go take a look in the garage. He gave me the keys, I walked out, looked in the garage, and this is what I found. I couldn't believe it. I bought the whole garage, boxes and all. This is a real treasure hunt. It's rafters to floor, full, uh, a two-car garage. So we're gonna go through this and see what we got. Looks like a hunt, uh, home run and we make the best of it. So I'm gonna cool my jets and, and take care of us, this King Tut find we found here. What everybody really wants to know is why did you do this on a Friday at a 100 degree temperature in Anaheim? Because when you're in this business, you pay, you load, you go. We got the call, Jim and Lindy Moss grow underneath his ass, waiting for the deal to be get done. We got over, he made a deal with one leg, man. <laughs> That's a fact. How many signs do you think he got out of this pick? 50 or 60? What do you think, Jeff? I'll tell you when I start listing them. This guy collected everything. This is crazy. More of that. Camel. This is like Coca-Cola collectibles. The whole thing is like this. Look at these commemorative pins. Here's brand new uh, Coke. Uh, leaded glass. I'm gonna probably find hundreds of nice pieces in here. We're gonna bring them to you all. Um, we're gonna have a big yard sale with all the crap, and we're gonna roll that out to the local people. Uh, we're gonna have a good time watching what's gonna happen there. I should have kept some of them. I love drinking beer. <laughs> With the 75 on the mailbox, you're at uh, 374. How much for the cash register? Yeah. <laughs> but more than their cash is in it. <laughs> See, are, yeah. we, are we giving good deals today? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yes. <laughs> you know, my our son, uh, he collects all Coca Cola. Oh. And they're going to do this for a wall. Oh, he's going to love that. Yeah, like, How are we doing, Tony? We must have broken grand at least already. halfway through the day and I got a lady coming back in a little bit I think it's gonna wipe me out and that's the way I like it let's get rid of all of it my name is Connie Gutierrez I have a store in Claremont California called artistic expressions all right so what you're gonna do is we'll get up and we'll walk around a little bit and uh, we will see uh, what we can negotiate and we'll take out some items and take in some items so what we're gonna do is I know that you do want the coke machine so let's go ahead and put the coke machine down at 250 the coke box okay. we'll get the big stuff out of the way first and then we'll go around to the little stuff and try to see how much it's worth. I know that you need to make money. I know you got a store. I don't have a problem with it. I don't want to take none of this back into my shop because okay. I don't really deal in smalls. The slot machine. Put it down or no? Uh, we'll negotiate, right? We can negotiate we'll do the big right ones, now. right? Because we're going to set the big stuff aside, right, on the paper, and then we'll talk about the smalls, right? right. That makes sense. We go back to those. Yeah. I, I know you cursory looked at it already, so you pretty much know. This is yeah. just do that. Mm -hmm. Uh, we've got a couple signs here. The railroad sign is. What about Magnet. this guy? Chain good. Chains. So well, I bought one from you. One keychain? No, one. Oh, a whole rack. rack. Oh, so you do like them. I'll see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's get to the good stuff. Okay. Cool. This is the kind of stuff you can use, though, right? Yeah, Coke but I wouldn't, and, I wouldn't pay that. Are you not going to eat by Boston This is the whole thing. <laughs> We're talking. I'm just trying to pitch here, right? Okay. That's all I'm trying to do is pitch. Uh, these uh, clearly it all goes with everything except what we're going to hold out. So the Coke machine at 250, the Biorhythm at 500, the Royal Crown at 500, the slot machine at 600. Tell me which ones you absolutely don't want, and I'm going to include the balance, right? We're going to negotiate, right? Fine. Which is fine, just you know, because I want you to get rid of whatever you don't want. Okay, cool. So now we're at the uh, Coke cooler and the slot machine. Okay, so here I have. Uh, seven fifty, uh, eight hundred fifty dollars. Okay, twenty-five hundred. 
2500 Counter? Uh, because I wouldn't pay that for that, and I wouldn't pay that for that. The most so, I'd pay for this is 150 And that one over there. Here, here here's, here's your pants. Since it's pants, um, I'm just going to explain why. Since it's pants and it's not dimes, it's harder to sell. I know all that. So on that, I probably only do 350 plus it's not working. Correct. So just those two alone, that's 500 Okay. Okay. Got it. Then I pretty much picked all the best stuff out of there already. I know you did. As you can see it in the back of my truck. And thank you very much for your business. And so for the rest of it, I mean, it's kind of, mm -mm. I mean, there's some good stuff and there's yeah, some not so good stuff. I understand. Stuff. So if I was going to hand pick what I wanted, no, probably, you got to take it all. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. If I was just going to hand pick what I wanted, there's probably about another $200 I would have took out of there. Right. Um, so I'll offer you another 100 over that. So 300, 300 for all that? More. Yeah. Yep. Make it a grand and take it all. That's fair. You're going to make dough and a it grand. Includes and it includes a slot machine, the Coke cooler, and all the rest of this crap. Stuff. Collectibles. I don't know what you think. You know, that's How about good. 900? How about 1,000? How about 11? Let's flip. How about 11? How about we flip, flip. again? Ooh, that'd all be right. a good one. All right, all right. That's a good flip. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Let me ring the register. How about the, re how about the register? Does that go with it? No. 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 <laughs> I already knew that one. You want a f flip or call? This time I'll flip. Yes, ma'am. Okay, you're calling it. Okay. Okay, ready? Go. Tails. Congratulations. Thank you. Okay, it's your sale. Let's go eat. Yay! All right, so this is the take for the day on the yard sale, garage sale, estate sale. So what we did here is, let's see what we got. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and we sold the lady the balance of the stuff for $900, so that's $2,100. And she is out there now, took over the sale. We, we just got out of the chairs and now she's out there doing business with the balance of, the, of our customers. And she's loving it, she's making money. I'm out, I'm done. The picked over on that stuff, we kept the good stuff, it's all going online. We're making a ton of money on that. And uh, here we go, that's that. Love this business.